Hey everybody, this is Industrial Action and I am bringing to you today a new video. Um, this is about a new way to solder LED engines and probably any other kind of main LED. Uh, one of the issues that I've run into lately is that when I'm doing my igniter builds, let's see if I can zoom in here, I've got to bridge all the positive wires together do the common positives. Um, so that takes time. It takes time, it takes effort, it takes a lot of heat, um, a lot of time with the soldering iron, a lot of moving around. So what I'm trying to do now is kind of simplify things. So what I've got here is my Presto little griddle, a piece of PCB breadboard from Radio Shack. I cut out a space for the lead engine to go right in there, and that sits right on the um, actual table here which will heat up in a bit. I've got my wires already laid out, taped down, um, I have everything pre-tinned so what this is really going to be is a matter of turning it on, heating it up, and believe it or not this will actually get hot enough really quick to melt the solder onto the pads um, so I won't need to use my iron at all and I'll just basically dip it really quickly into my jar of flux touch the pads and uh, it should work. So again these things can take a lot of heat. Lead engines for sure can take a lot of heat. I'm not going to go really that high. Uh, what I will probably get to is somewhere around between 300 and 350 degrees uh, which is what I usually solder at so nothing exciting here. I mean for the lead engines I bump that up to you know 400 plus Celsius so right now um, We'll go ahead and do it. Now the one problem that I have here is obviously I can't hold the phone and record while I'm doing it. So I'm going to pause it here and I will come back and show you the finished product. Alright, now I'm back in action here. So you can see that uh, my experiment, by the way that was an experiment, um, was a success. So I've got everything soldered up here. Um, it took me probably about 30 seconds once it got to temperature to solder all the wires on. Uh, the PCB got a little hot. You can see some discoloration there, but nothing major. I mean, everything looked good. Nothing melted uh, except solder. So I'm really happy with it. Um, what I'll do next is just see if I can figure out a way to prop up the phone to take some video, and I will show you how it works. Alright, hopefully this will hold. Um, we'll go ahead and do some testing. So let's see. Grab my common positive here. Put that on my battery pack. We'll do amber, blue, red, and where's my green wire? and green. Alright, that does it. Everything works. Um, I don't know if it's a new method, but it is a cool new method that I'm going to try, so I hope you enjoy. Thanks.